um, the Michigan Science Center, welcoming back families this weekend with free admission. That's where we find Fox 2's Veronica Meadows this morning, keeping an eye on all the cool science things going on right now. Veronica, good morning. Hey Jay, we do have a really fun science activity to show you in a little bit. First, we want to talk about how families are social distancing. One of the ways that they're doing just that, you can see uh, those lines, really mark making sure the families are staying six feet apart. Christian, tell us a little bit more about how you all are making sure that people keep their space and families continue to respect each other's space when they're here. Well, safety is very important, especially for families with young children. And one of our most popular things are our science stage shows. We have these big demonstrations. We show off different things in physics and chemistry and we want to make sure that people can sit in the area and observe the show but we also have them space so you'll see it demarcated here with yellow tape and it's actually eight foot increments in spaces so we give a little play in there for people to feel comfortable bringing their family and having a good time and then so since this science museum is so hands-on you can't really get away from <laughs> having right. you know kids and families you know kind of looking at everything and touching everything but you have something called the clean team. Yeah, we have the clean team. We're hands-on, minds-on, so we also like to talk about the conceptual sides of science, um, but we have our clean team for people when you touch things and you interact, you can still do that. And this team will go around, they'll have these vests on in our sort of airport theme of getting the flow going and creating spacing. And they will come by and make sure, it's almost like at the auto show, where you touch the cars and you have those detailers come out and make sure they stay clean. That's what we're doing here at MySci. Nice, so definitely making sure everything's wiped down a lot and making sure that those families can uh, stay uh, six feet, more than six feet, eight feet away from yes, each other. Yes. So we're also here with David Cleary, Cleary excuse me, he's from uh, Aremco. You're the company who made this all possible for everybody to have free general admission. Tell us a little bit more about you know what made you want to step up and help everybody get them free this summer. Sure, so we're really happy to be here. Science, engineering, technology is really core uh, for our company. Uh, it's really quite important for, for all of us, in fact. So we, we support STEM activities uh, where we operate globally. We have a center here in, in Detroit, Michigan. So we're really happy to be here uh, at the Michigan Science Center. The Michigan Science Center is uh, really supporting our next generation of engineers and scientists. So uh, it's a great place to come, great place to learn. Uh, have a lot of fun and to be inspired. And I know you all have uh, some offices in the Detroit area as well. Is that one of the reasons that you wanted to really help give back to uh, this organization in the center? Yeah, so we're part of the Detroit community now for some time. So uh, we have an office in Nova a Research Center. So we're very, very pleased to be, again, working with the Michigan Science Center and giving back. Wonderful. Okay, so we have to end with a fun activity. Yeah, sure. And it was sanitized before we uh, practiced yes. as well. So tell us, uh, Christian, tell us what this so is. So what I have here is a gyroscope, and I'll give you this here. It's just like a spinning top, and these are things that we're very familiar with. But the Earth spins around, too. And that spinning along an axis allows it to be stabilized. And these are used for aircraft and that sort of thing. So I'm going to give this a really good spin. And then I'm going to put it right here. Now, normally this would fall over, but balancing your palm there, Whoa. you can see it spinning around. And this uh, represents conservation of angular momentum. We have a uh, rotational inertia that keeps it where it wants to be. And so just like the Earth, this would be pointing to the star Polaris, which is the pole star. And the spacecraft use it for navigation. Aircraft use it for heading indicators and turn coordinators. So this is an awesome thing. We have these in the store. They sell like crazy, and they're fun for kids. What? Oh, my goodness. This is so cool, I think. <laughs> How, how long does this last? We'll have to find out. That's part of the experiment to see how long it goes. I know. I, we, we should have started a stopwatch or something. It's been a couple seconds, though. And yeah. these are, oh, no, there oh, it goes. Okay. They're well, indestructible. They lasted for a while. That's, That's right. good. They're indestructible. That way kids can have fun, too. So these are in your gift shop. Thank you so much, Christian. That was yeah. a blast. Uh, if you want to check that out, again, that's in their gift shop. And we'll be here all morning long show you some, uh, showing you rather some more fun science experiments. So stick around. But for now, we'll see you after the break.